so last we left off with Arma, she was not having a good day, just to say the least. Um, I know you guys can't say much, but can you at least tease us where do we find Arma in, in her emotional state? Um, so, I'm just gonna say I. So I'm still grieving, obviously, and anyone who unfortunately has dealt with the loss of a loved one knows that it's not about the passage of time on a clock. You know, um, grief comes in waves and there's many different stages and everybody has their own process and their own journey with how that affects them and what it blocks them from feeling and what it inspires them to feel and she's going through all of it. And they do not shy away from complicated emotions in this show, so it's all there. And on this new platform, uh, Greg and Brandon have been allowed to explore this um, storyline in a much more adult way. Is it feeling different coming back now? I mean, after the break? It definitely break. feels different. Um, well, the stories are more mature. And it's um, a darker, sexier, scarier, sadder, more exciting universe a little bit. And, and you know it already started off good. So um, they're just a little bit more liberated to tell the story. Like I said, in a more evolved adult way. Um, there was a five year gap between season one and two, um, but not in terms of our recording it. But then there was a five year gap between recording season two and three. So it's kind of a weird catch up in some way, you know, in my personal life. Um, when I first started the show, I was young, newly married. I had two dogs. It was my first series. Now I've done plenty of series. I've had three kids. Both of those dogs have passed away because, you know, they're old and it's just like so much life has happened. And then you look at our country and the world and yeah. social media and everything that's going on. And just, it's great to have a superhero show that talks about all this stuff in very veiled metaphors. And I'm, I'm proud to be a part of this. Well, there was a lot. There's a lot of excitement around the show, and the producers were saying everybody wanted to come back. We didn't have to ask anybody. What was it about this that made you want to hang on to it so long? And just want to come back so much. It's just, it's good. It's good storytelling. Um, it's done right. There's so much respect. I feel like these two writers, Greg and Brandon, um, you can trust them, and their knowledge of the universe is so vast, and they um, don't play around with anything, they don't half-ass anything, you know, they take such care, and they listen, and they learn, and they're sticklers, and they're stubborn for all the right reasons. I always say they really do suffer for their art so that their art doesn't suffer, they do not want to disappoint the fans, their fans themselves, I mean... It's just a really smart and um, cared for show. And everybody feels, I think, honored like I do to be a part of it. It's just not an afterthought. It's not a means to an end. It 